followed by Jason Gastworth, our Senior Vice President of Marketing and Entertainment for Caesars Entertainment. Our special guest, Brett Gallagher, who is the President of Southern California and Las Vegas for Live Nation Entertainment. And Caesars Entertainment's Chairman, President, and Chief Executive Officer, Mr. Gary Lovman. And with that, I would like to turn the stage over to David Honeymeyer. Thank you, Emily. Good morning to everybody. It's such an exciting day, not only for Planet Hollywood, for, but for all the team members gathered here today, and for all our sponsors and partners that we're so happy to have with us today. As you know, the Planet Hollywood brand has a very special connection with celebrity and entertainment. Each year, stars from around the globe visit us here in the heart of Las Vegas to experience the Las Vegas Strip, the great entertainment, dining, shopping that Planet Hollywood has become famous for. Today marks yet another great milestone for the resort as we introduce to you our crown jewel and the city's newest premier entertainment destination, the Axis. The Axis boasts, boasts a rich history, having first opened in July of 1976, originally as the Aladdin Theater for the Performing Arts. The venue has a tradition of providing audiences with first-class entertainment, starting with the inaugural performance by Neil Diamond. Through the years, it has served as a home for numerous telecasts, pageants, and award shows, and so many top acts of the past few years that there's too many to name. But because I'm such a music fan myself, I'll rattle off just a few. The impressive roster includes Eric Clapton, Queen, Pearl Jam, Radiohead, Justin Timberlake, Dave Matthews, and of course, Justin Bieber. Today we share our excitement with each and every one of you as we embark upon a new chapter in the history of this great theater. As you can see, we are confident the Axis will play a pivotal role in continuing our courtship of a new, younger generation here at Planet Hollywood. And it all starts in just over a week with the launch of the theater's first resident artist, Britney Spears. With a solid foundation as its base and a new state-of-the-art design, the theater is primed to return to the forefront of Las Vegas' entertainment scene. And it all starts here on December 27th with Britney Spears, A Piece of Me. Thank you very much. So good morning, everyone, and welcome to our new theater. Three and a half years ago, we bought Planet Hollywood with the ambition of adding a great new brand that would appeal to a different segment of audience from the positions we have here in the city overall. And we've been very fortunate that this has worked out exceptionally well. This caters to the younger, more entertainment-oriented audience that is occupying an increasing portion of visitors to Las Vegas. With the arrival of the Axis Theater and First Britney Spears, and now this tremendous partnership with Live Nation, we are trying to establish a second celebrity residence experience for customers in this city that has a younger generation of A-plus entertainers, whereas, for example, Caesars Palace and the Coliseum has historically offered an A-plus level of entertainment at a different generation, with Celine and with Elton and with Shania and Rod Stewart and Cher and the like. That has been enormously successful for us at Caesars Palace and has really established Caesars Entertainment positioning in the celebrity category, and we believe this will be a very important second step in that process here at Planet Hollywood. So let me emphasize, as my colleagues did, our enthusiasm for what's happening on the east side of the Strip. Today begins a process of the arrival of very exciting new things on the east side. Here with the naming of the Axis Theater and the arrival of the Live Nation Partnership, we begin. Brittany follows here very shortly. We'll be opening the first few shops at the entrance to the lake just after the holiday. You'll begin to see the wheel, the high roller, start to turn at the beginning of the year as we begin testing of that uh, exciting new attraction for the city. You see that Victor Dre's new nightclub and hotel with us at the corner of Flamingo and Las Vegas Boulevard is beginning to look a little bit like it will when it's finished. We have the world's greatest nightclub operator in Victor, greatest partner for this establishment. We have Giada's new restaurant beginning to show what it might look like at the corner. And this will be the arrival of, I think, an unprecedented set of new entertainment-oriented, highly branded attractions on the east side of this trip. We're very excited about it. So this begins a journey that I think will serve us and our customers exceptionally well. Thanks for joining us. We hope you enjoy a look at the theater here in just a few minutes. 
and I'll turn it back over now to Emily. So the, for, for Brittany, for most of the time, there'll be oh, really? a VIP seat like, arrangement. There's a, a sample layout yeah, there. She We've was got the daughter soft of seating and a Chicago dedicated and, table. But yeah, I was um, there when she was there, Bob and Benoit, my dad, and I used to shoot all the stars. You know, I'd get one of my great kind of that kind of seating uh, product to a stage. And really, it's about it's been about creating a sense of energy at the at the core of the performance. The architecture takes a little bit of a Look, we already split. Yeah.